Hey guys, Happy New Year! I hope you are doing well. Today we are going to play with some baby sharks and really friendly stingrays. Where are we going to do that? I'll be going to the Marine Park Nikusu over at Noboribetsu in Hokkaido, Japan. I will be storing my luggage at the station, but you can also do that at the marine park. That castle there is actually the marine park. Just walk in that direction, there'll be signs along the way. I think the best time to visit is February because the snow makes it look really awesome. This place is modelled after the Iskov Castle in Denmark, which is also known as the Castle Floating on the Lake. Today, the lake has been frozen over. And there's a swan. Hi! The park organises tours and talk shows for children to learn about marine creatures and how they live. This is the Stingray Touch Pool. You can get close and personal with these small and friendly stingrays. Make sure you clean your hands thoroughly before placing them in the water. So, what do they feel like? It's an oddly satisfying feeling. They're really slimy and slippery. Their wings are so, so soft, but at the same time, they're also very firm. Oh look, baby shark! So yeah, it just feels amazingly good and it is extremely addictive. I've already spent a whole hour here. Oh, it's your hey, little pet. Oh. oh, that's rough. Maybe pick you up? No? Yes? Mm, you're cute. There's also a horseshoe crab touch pond. These guys are our important friends. Their blood has incredible antibacterial properties and are thus used for biomedical purposes. Unfortunately, this is also one of the reasons why they are now endangered. So if you ever see one stranded on its back, remember to help flip them over and guide them back in the water. I've seen these around before, but it's the first time seeing a baby cling on to the stinger of the adult. It's really adorable. Uh, they just crash into a rock. And they're doing a great job getting out of the crash. Nice. Oh my god. I think I found my favorite fish. 
This is the Kichiji rockfish, but I'm going to call it the plankfish. Over here we have pretty little sea angels. They're actually tiny slugs that can swim. They amaze me. If you're hungry, there are some restaurants and gift shops connected to the entrance building. Right next to it are some sea doggos. This one's looking at me. And there's another one that looks at me every time he does a lap. There's more to see, but I have to go back to the Onsen Hotel because I don't want to miss dinner. I'm staying at Hotel Daiichi. It is the New Year's and I just love the festive decorations. Here's a quick room tour. It is a decent room, but not fancy at all. The selling point of this place is the entertainment. Onsen hotel rooms always give you a little snack. And if you like it, you can buy them downstairs at the souvenir shop. includes dinner which is a buffet downstairs. This is coffee in a green tea cup. There are the usual Japanese favorites, plenty of seafood, Hokkaido crab which is probably a big deal and this is fake. Here's my shot glass of veggies. Natto, fermented soybeans. Not sure why you need these at an onsen hotel, but yeah. Let's go outside. This little shop has the best ice cream ever. I always have to eat at least two cones whenever I visit. The best one is black sesame, very aromatic. Next stop is 7-Eleven. Hokkaido melon is very famous, and I don't think I've ever seen this drink elsewhere before. If you're not doing the hotel dinner package, you can always have a good meal of fried chicken and bento boxes here. That's our hotel at the end of the road, and we're going to look at some souvenir shops. And there are toilet seat covers where you can touch. You can touch. Got chopstick holders. To go with it. Okay, I'm just gonna voice over. I came here looking for nail clippers and yes, they have it. They also have a lot of other stuff that I'm sure you'll probably need. The stationery is super cute. Look at these letter pads. The design and paper quality is amazing. Can you see that sheen? And it's only for 100 yen. I got some bowls and spoons too. This is the hotel mascot. He is a little demon. Our beds have been set for us and this is such an adorable notice. 
you have to check out by 10 a.m. But it's going to be extremely crowded. <laughs> Hi, it's me again. I just wanted to say a big thank you to you all uh, for supporting me, for watching my videos till now. I really appreciate that. I love sharing Japan content, especially my trips to Hokkaido. I hope you like the place as much as I do. And if you haven't been there, definitely visit. I'll keep on trying my very best to upload as much Japan content as I could edit them. I really want to keep this going. So yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye!